in this video we are going to discuss about two commands here those are access list logging and access list remarks so coming to access list logging you see this access list logging is accomplished using the optional log keyword used in the access list command with the set of the syntax and also when access is created that means when access list is created it is also created or mentioned with access list command so what is this log keyword for the log keyword causes an informational syntax of logging message and about the packet that matches the entry that needs to be denied or permit here that means this log is used to information logging message that means you should have the information about the denying and permitting of the traffic of the data packets and the log message includes the access list number whether the packet was permitted to pass through to the source from destination and also vice versa that from destination to source and you see about the number of packets also mentioned in that log message so this is about the access list log message which is used with the access list command and it is created with the access list so coming to access list remarks so you can include comments or remarks about the access list and individual entries and named ip addresses here so coming to the remarks the access list remarks is simply an optional comment before the permit or deny of the access list entry that describes the entry in a plain text format so to get the information about what is getting denied or that means what what data is getting denied and what data is getting permitted here so coming to the remark can go before and after a permit or a deny, deny command so that you should be consistent about where you have been denying this and also your remarks is clear that where it has to be permitted so this is about the two commands in access list which are access list logging and access list remarks which we use in when we are using the access list command here